Jeremy Hunt has announced that Esther McVeigh would be his deputy prime minister if he wins the conservative leadership contest in a deal which has blown the contest wide open. In a surprise announcement Mr Hunt revealed that his campaign had brought the two wings of the party together with a deal to make Ms McVeigh his duty prime minister. He told the BBC, I also recognise that the leader of a political party has to win elections, and that means a broad appeal, so just as Tony Blair had John Prescott to broaden his appeal as his deputy prime minister, I will have Esther McVeigh as my deputy prime minister. She has won a lot of elections against Labour in the North, I have won them against Lib Dems in the South and I think we will be a formidable campaigning team. Mr Hunt was both Foreign Secretary and Health Secretary and comes with huge government experience while Ms McVeigh was Work and Pensions Secretary. In an article in The Express last week I set out the five priorities that are essential for the Conservative Party and its new leader. Jeremy Hunt has pledged to accept and deliver on all five of those priorities, so much for anyone who thinks that I am selling out on my principles. The announcement changes the dynamic of a packed leadership contest with Penny Mordaunt also announcing this morning joining Tom Tugent Hat, Grant Shapps, Sweller Braverman, Kimi Badinok, Rishi Sunak and Nadim Zahawi as declared candidates. Ms McVeigh said, I, as the co-founder of the Blue Collar Conservatives, can appeal better to those Red Wall voters, many of whom voted for us for the first time at the last election. She said, in this leadership contest it would be easy for us all to retreat into our own ideological tribes, but that is not going to give us the best chance of winning the next general election. 